Welcome, welcome, one and all, to freedom, reign, empowerment for Jesus Christ, healing, deliverance, and the fire of God. Ministry unto the Lord, midday service. Please tag and share and invite someone so that they can be blessed on today. I was glad when they said to me, let us go into the house of the Lord. Let us worship as the Lord is looking for worshipers that will worship him in spirit and in truth. So arise, worshipers. Let's worship the Lord this morning. Hallelujah. 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 We bless your name, Lord. We bless your name. We bless your name. Hallelujah, we magnify your name. Hallelujah, we lift you up high. Hallelujah, glory. Glory, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lord, I failed you. Jesus. How often, Lord, I failed you. Hallelujah. Jesus. I confess, Lord, in sorrow I confess, Lord, mindful of how much I fall short of your righteous holy.
If we walk, hallelujah, glory be to God, hallelujah. If we say we have no sin, we deceive ourselves and the truth is not in us. If we confess our sin, he is faithful and just to forgive us of our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. John chapter 7, John chapter 1 verses 7 through nine hallelujah this is the word of the lord thank be to god welcome welcome one and all to freedom reign empowerment for jesus christ he is deliverance and the fire of god ministry unto the lord my name is sister Tikisha, and i'm more than happy to be your host on today this is our midday service. Please tag and share and invite as much people as you can so that they can be blessed on today. The Lord bless you and keep you. Make his face shine upon and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face towards you and gave you peace the lord bless you and keep you make his face shine upon and be gracious to you the lord turn his Face towards you and give you peace. Amen. 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 
May his favor be upon you to a thousand generation, to your family and your children and their children and their children. May his favor be upon you to a thousand generation, to your family and your children and their children and their children. May his presence be upon you, go before you, be behind you, all around you. He is with you, within you, he is within you. In the morning, in the evening, when you're coming, when you're going, he is for you, he is for you, he is for you, he is for you. Amen. 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 In Amen. 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 The Lord bless you. shine upon and be gracious to you. Lord, turn his face towards you and give you peace. Oh. Be upon you to a thousand generation, to your family, to your children, and their children, and their children. May his presence be upon you, go before you, be behind you, all around you. He is with you, he is with you, he is with you. When you're coming, when you're going, in the morning, in the evening, he is for you, he is for you. He is for you, he is for you, he is for you. Amen. 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 In amen. 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 Slow. shine upon and be gracious to you Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace In Amen, Amen, Amen. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah, you're worthy, God. Hallelujah, we bless your name, we bless your name, you bless your name. Oh, we magnify your name on today, Lord Jesus. Oh, we love you, El Shaddai. Oh, we love you, Jehovah Nisi. Oh, we love you, Jehovah El Shaddai. 
Oh, we love you, Jehovah El Shaddai. Oh, we love you, Jehovah Hamashak. We love you, 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 Emmanuel. God is with us. We thank you, Lord, for your presence in our midst, for your presence upon this broadcast, for your presence upon this service, Lord. We thank you. We welcome you, Holy Spirit, to have your way on today. Let it be all of you and none of us, Jesus, take the wheel. Oh, we thank you, we thank you, we thank you. We bless your name, Lord. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. We give sacrifice of praise into the house of the Lord. We bring sacrifice of praise into the house of the Lord. And we offer up to you the sacrifice seeds of thanksgiving. And we offer up to you the sacrifice seeds of praise we bring sacrifice of praise into the house of the lord we bring sacrifice of praise into the house of the lord and we offer up to you the sacrifices of thanksgiving and we offer up to you the sacrifices of praise come on and bless the lord with me 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 sing holly hallelujah holly 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 hallelujah holly 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 hallelujah come on and give him the glory hallelujah come on Come on and do your dance with me. Come on and do your dance with me. Come on, come on, come on and do your dance with me. Hallelujah. And do your dance with me. Sing it. Halle, hallelujah. Halle, halle, halle. Hallelujah. Halle, halle, halle. Come on and give him the praise, hallelujah. Let's dance before his name, hallelujah. Come on and give him the glory, hallelujah. Halle, 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 hallelujah. Let's come on, give him the praise, hallelujah. Halle, 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 hallelujah. Come on and do your thing with me. Come on and do your thing with me. Come on, come on, come on and do your thing with me. Come on, come on, come on, do your thing with me. Sing it. Halle, hallelujah. Halle, 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 hallelujah. Halle, 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 hallelujah. Come on and give him the glory, hallelujah. Come on and give him the praise, hallelujah. Halle, 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 hallelujah. Come on and give him the glory, hallelujah. Come on and give him the praise, hallelujah. 
come on and bless the Lord with me. We bless your name, Lord Jesus. Come on and bless the Lord with me. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Bless the Lord with me. Come on, come on, come on and bless the Lord with me. Let's sing it loud and clear it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Salvation and glory, honor and power unto the Lord our God. For the Lord our God is mighty. Yes, the Lord our God is a mifatan and the Lord our oh God. He is wonderful. Hallelujah, hallelujah, salvation and glory, honor and power. He is wonderful. All praises be to the King. Of King and the Lord, oh God is wonderful. Hallelujah, 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 Hallelujah. He is wonderful. Salvation and glory, honor and power unto the Lord our God. For the Lord our God is mighty. Yes, the Lord our God is omnipotent, and the Lord our God, He is wonderful. King of King and the Lord, oh God, He is wonderful. All oh, praises be to the King of King and the Lord, oh God, He is wonderful. Oh, King of King and the Lord, oh God, He is wonderful. Hallelujah, 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 Hallelujah. He is wonderful. Done. 
we are so blessed, our soul is at rest, oh Lord, we give you thanks, 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 we give you thanks, for all you done. We are so blessed. Our soul is at rest. Oh Lord, we give you thanks. Thanks, thanks. We give you thanks for all you had done. We are so blessed. Our soul is at rest. Oh Lord, we give you thanks. Oh Lord, we give you thanks. Oh Lord, we give you thanks. Hallelujah, you are the Lord. Hallelujah, we bless your name. Hallelujah, we magnify you. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. Lead us not into temptation, deliver us from all evil, for thine in the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. We pray to your Father, thank you for your Holy Spirit, and most to Jesus' precious blood. Let manna to our soul be given. The bread of life sent down from heaven for Christ's sake. Amen. Oh, Father in heaven, we humbly come before your throne this evening, thanking you for your love and your grace. We thank you for the gratitude, hallelujah, of the night that passed. Father, we thank you for all you have done, what you are about to do, what you still yet have to come. We give you the praise, we give you the honor, we give you the glory because you are worthy, you deserve it, Lord. We ask, Father Lord, that you have your way on this service tonight, on this service today, on this service this evening, Lord, on this service this morning, wherever, whoever they are watching, the time, the location. I pray, Father, in the name of Jesus, that you will pour out upon them a fresh anointing, a fresh wind, a fresh fire of the Holy Ghost, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we ask that you have your way. Let it be all of you and none of me. Jesus, take the wheel. Let the words of our mouth, the meditation of our heart be acceptable in thy sight, O God, our strength and our redeemer. Bless those coming in. Bless those coming out from this time for even forevermore. Father God, let us, Father God, hallelujah, as we humbly come before your throne today. Speak to us for your servants here at Lord. We we pray all that you're going to pour out today. Uh, hallelujah. Our oh, brain going to be like a sponge absorb. Uh, hallelujah. Not just be hearers, but doers of your word, oh God. Uh, revive those that need reviving. Save those that need saving. Deliver those that need deliverance. Uh, set free those that need set free. Uh, Lord, in the name of Jesus, you have your way, oh God. Uh, not my will, your will be done on today, Holy Spirit. Uh, not my will, your will be done on today. God, not my will, your will be done on today, Jesus. Um, 
Have your way, have your way. Father, we thank you and we praise you on today. Hallelujah. In Jesus' mighty, precious name. Bless the reading of your scripture on today. Bless the messenger on today. Let it be all of you and none of the messenger. Jesus, take the wheel. We thank you for your favor. We thank you for your glory. We thank you for a fresh outpouring of your anointing. We just thank you, Lord. We love you, Lord, because you first love us. Hallelujah. We bless your name on today. In Jesus' mighty, precious name, we are praying. Amen. Amen. And amen. Welcome, welcome, one and all, to Freedom Reign Empowerment for Jesus Christ, Healing Deliverance, and the Frank God Ministry unto the Lord, Midday Service. Today, if I have a message for you, it will be the message of hope. Somebody say, the message of hope. This will be the title of the sermonette on today, the message of hope. I asked the Lord last night, what it is you want to speak to your people on today? He said, a message of hope. And I said, what scripture? And then he said, go to the book of Matthew. Matthew chapter 10, verses 32. If you have your Bible, please turn with me to the book of Matthew chapter 10, verses 32. I'm going to be reading from the King James Version. And it reads, Whosoever, therefore, shall confess me before men, him will I confess also before my Father which is in heaven. But whosoever shall deny me before men, him will I also deny before my Father which is in heaven. Think not that I am come to send peace on earth. I come not to send peace but a sword. For I am come to set a man at variance against his father and the daughter against her mother and the daughter-in-law against her mother-in-law. And a man's foes shall be they of his own household. He that loveth father or mother more than me is not worthy of me. And he that loveth son or daughter more than me is not worthy of me. And he that taketh not his cross and followeth after me is not worthy of me. He that findeth his life shall lose it. And he that loseth his life for my sake shall find it. He that receiveth you receiveth me, and he that receiveth me receiveth him that sent me. He that receiveth a prophet in the name of a prophet shall receive a prophet's reward. And he that receiveth a righteous man in the name of a righteous man shall receive a righteous man reward. And whosoever shall give to drink unto one of these little ones a cup of cold water only in the name of a disciple. Verily I say unto you, he shall in no wise lose his reward. This is the word of the Lord. Thank be to God. Brethren, if I have a topic or a title for you today, it will be a message of hope. Our hope is found in Jesus Christ. The songwriter sing, My hope is built on nothing less But Jesus Christ, His righteousness. Brethren, the scripture says, Whosoever, You are that whosoever, I am that whosoever, We are that whosoever, Therefore shall confess a lot of people say, well, you are not Lord. When you go and you minister to people, not everyone are the same. But there are some that you go to minister to and you tell them. The Bible says in Romans chapter 10 verses 9 and 10, If thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus and believe in thine heart that God has raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. For with the heart man believeth unto righteousness, but with the mouth confession is made known unto salvation. And some people says, well, who are you that I have to confess to you? We, have, we bring that to correction because it is not I that you are confessing to, but it is 
the Lord Jesus you are confessing to. But you are making that confession, hallelujah, in front of me. The Bible says, whosoever therefore shall confess me before men. Amen. Hallelujah. I am a woman. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. Amen. And in the word woman, hallelujah, we see woman, W-O-M-E-N. So when you're confessing before me, the Lord Jesus, amen, you're not confessing exactly to me, but you're confessing to the Lord, hallelujah, in the presence of, hallelujah, his men, servant, his woman, servant, hallelujah, oh, glory be to God, amen, hallelujah, so it says, whosoever therefore shall confess me before men, him will I confess also before my father, which is in heaven, now we know in the Catholic churches, hallelujah the people go to the priest uh, hallelujah and they go and they confess their sin nothing is wrong with that why because the bible says hallelujah whosoever therefore shall confess me who is me jesus christ hallelujah not the pope not the pastors not the priests not the apostles hallelujah not the messengers hallelujah not not, not, not the presidents, not the prime ministers, not our mother, father, sister, brothers, auntie, uncle, nieces, nephew, neighbors, or even our enemy. No. Hallelujah. Not Buddha, Allah, or Muhammad. Amen. Hallelujah. Not Jezebel or Ahab. Hallelujah. But it says, whosoever therefore shall confess of me. Who is me? Jesus. Hallelujah. Christ. Amen. He said, whosoever therefore shall confess me before men. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Him will i confess also before my father which is in heaven so brethren hallelujah if we hallelujah does not or is afraid or ashamed to confess jesus christ before men hallelujah jesus hallelujah will be ashamed of us and he will therefore not confess us before our father his father which is in heaven amen hallelujah so it says whosoever therefore shall confess me before men him will i confess also before my father which is in heaven so i challenge you brethren if you are not save and somebody come up to you and ask would you like to receive the free gift of eternal life and you say what's that and they say to you john 3 16 and 17 says for god so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believeth in him will not perish but will have eternal life and god did not send his love into the world to condemn the world but that the world through him might be saved hallelujah oh glory be to god and then it goes on to say, hallelujah, Romans 10, 9 and 10, as it is written, says, If thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus, hallelujah. So in the midst of that person witnessing to you, whether it's in your home, whether it's on the corner, whether it's in a church, hallelujah, whether it's at a revival, if thou shalt confess, hallelujah, with thy mouth, wherever you are, you can confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus. It doesn't necessarily have to be in a church building hallelujah wherever you are you can confess the lord jesus with your mouth and believe in your heart that jesus that god has raised him from the dead and you will be saved you shall be saved amen hallelujah oh glory be to god so brethren if someone come and minister to you at the roadside and people passing and driving by don't be ashamed to confess the lord jesus why because if you're ashamed to confess the lord jesus before men uh, hallelujah jesus will be uh, hallelujah ashamed of you and he will not confess uh, hallelujah oh glory to god you before his father which is in heaven amen hallelujah so i challenge you brethren there's nothing to be ashamed of you don't have to be ashamed of your faith you don't have to be ashamed of jesus christ you don't have to be ashamed of god because if you're ashamed of him he will be ashamed of you and you don't want god you don't want jesus to be ashamed of you amen hallelujah oh glory be to god so brethren i challenge you when someone come and minister to you the gospel of jesus christ hallelujah oh glory be to god and they say to you hallelujah 
hallelujah as it is written whosoever shall confess me before and the thing about it is a lot of people ask question why do i have to confess amen hallelujah before you hallelujah if they ask this question why do i have to confess before you when you minister to them hallelujah romans 10 9 and 10 hallelujah you then go to the book of matthew hallelujah chapter 10 verses 32 hallelujah to 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 edify them to 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 uh, enlighten their understanding amen hallelujah to let them understand and know that it is not because of you or it's not you but it is the lord's word hallelujah oh glory be to god and the lord says in his word hallelujah that is faithful that is truth hallelujah whosoever therefore shall confess me before men him will i confess also before my father which is in heaven amen hallelujah and it says but whosoever shall deny me hallelujah hallelujah before men him will i also deny before my father which is in heaven brethren when jesus was with his disciples having the the last meal he said one of you gonna betray me hallelujah and the disciples start asking question is it me is it me oh glory be to god he said before hallelujah peter said lord i will not deny you and the lord jesus said before hallelujah hallelujah oh glory be to god i believe it's the hour of three hallelujah the clock um before the clock strikes three hall before the cock crow hallelujah <laughs> hallelujah uh one of you will deny me three times amen hallelujah yes that's it uh, hallelujah before the cock crow cock -a -da -da -da! one of you will deny me three times and peter hallelujah was that one who denied jesus christ three times before men amen but let me tell you brethren god is a forgiving god even if you deny jesus before men he is able and just to forgive you of all your unrighteousness jesus forgive peter because peter remained jesus apostle he remained jesus disciple amen even though he denied jesus jesus forgive him hallelujah when jesus was on the cross what did jesus say he said father forgive them for they know not what they're doing amen hallelujah glory be to god he didn't hold it against peter for denying him three times before men hallelujah but instead he said father forgive them for they know not what they're doing amen hallelujah so we see here it says but whosoever shall deny me before men him will i also deny before my father which is in heaven brethren we don't want jesus to deny us hallelujah before my father in heaven amen hallelujah oh glory be to god you don't want jesus to deny you before our father in heaven so i challenge you this day hallelujah don't be afraid when his messenger come with the message of confession the message of reconciliation the message of repentance the message of salvation hallelujah don't be afraid when they say to you, you have to confess with your mouth the lord jesus and believe in your heart that god has raised him from the dead and you will be saved hallelujah glory be to god hallelujah 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 we bless the name of the lord glory be to god hallelujah thank you jesus hallelujah 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 with my voice do you feel up and my mouth filled with praise With a heart of thanksgiving I will bless thee, O oh Lord Hallelujah I challenge you, brethren When messengers of God Come bearing the message of confession the message of repentance, the message of reconciliation, the message of salvation. And they say to you, 
or if you ask them then what shall i do to be saved and they said well according to romans 10 9 and 10 it says if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the lord jesus and be and believe in thy heart that god has raised him from the dead thou shalt be saved for the heart man believe it unto righteousness but with the mouth confession is made known unto salvation amen hallelujah and if they said that you have to confess hallelujah oh glory be to god don't be ashamed to confess the Lord Jesus before that person, amen, or before that individual, or before that congregation, amen, hallelujah, because if you deny Jesus, amen, he will deny you before the Father in heaven, amen, hallelujah, if you deny that Jesus Christ is Lord, he will deny you before the Father in heaven, amen, hallelujah, oh glory be to God, and then it goes on to say, think not that I am come to send peace on earth, I come not to send peace, but a sword. Brethren, this is a sword, the word of God. Amen. Hallelujah. You see this thing behind me? It's a sword. And the two edge is sharp, right? The word of God is sharp like a two edged sword. And it pierces hearts. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. So, there are times you will not feel comfortable. There are times you will feel uncomfortable and it's okay. It, why? Because, you know, uncomfortableness, hallelujah, it brings us into alignment with the Lord. Hallelujah, it brings us into alignment to the word of God. Hallelujah, amen. Hallelujah, said, think not that I am come to send peace on earth. Hallelujah. I come not to send peace, but a sword. Amen. I come not to send peace, but a sword. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. For I am come to set a man at variance against his father and the daughter against his mother. But brethren, there's a time where there's a time where father will be against daughters and mothers will be against daughters and in-laws will be against mother-in-laws amen hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah and i believe these things are happening before our very own eyes hallelujah and if you are not seeing it i pray the lord removes scares and blindness from your eyes so that you can see amen hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah and then it says and a man's foe shall be the of his own household hallelujah hallelujah your enemy is of your own household amen bloodline family church family your enemies of your own household amen hallelujah and then it says he that loveth father or mother more than me brethren we should not love our mother and father more than we love god or jesus christ amen god first others then self amen god other self god other self because the bible and 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 when we because the Bible said, Love the Lord thy God with all your heart, my soul, body, and spirit. And it says, Love your neighbors as yourself. Amen. When you love God, you know what love is, and you're able to love yourself. Amen. And in loving yourself, in knowing the love of God and what the love of God is, you are able to love your neighbors as you love yourself because you know God and you love God and you know that God is love. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. So we see here, Amen. It says, Hallelujah. He that loveth father or mother more than he than me is not worthy of me. So, brethren, you see, if you love father and mother more than Jesus Christ, you are not worthy of Jesus Christ. Amen. You are not worthy of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. And then it says, and he that loveth son or daughter more than me is not worthy of me. So, if you love your children more than you love Jesus Christ, you are not worthy of Jesus Christ. Amen. And then it says, and he that taketh not his cross, hallelujah. Hallelujah, oh glory to God. The Bible says, deny yourself. Hallelujah, oh glory to God. We are not to deny Jesus Christ. We are to deny ourselves. Amen. Hallelujah. Take up our cross and follow Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Brethren, if we deny Jesus, hallelujah, and save our life, well, it says, what, what, what shall it profit a man? Hallelujah. Oh, all right. So if we, if we save our life, we're going to lose it. But if we lose our life, we're going we're gonna to save it for God's sake. We're gonna, you understand what I'm saying? hallelujah oh glory to god so so we are not to deny jesus christ because if we deny jesus christ he's going to deny us before the father what we're supposed to do is deny ourselves take up our cross hallelujah take up our cross hallelujah and follow jesus christ daily amen take up our cross and follow jesus christ daily take up our cross hallelujah and follow jesus christ daily amen hallelujah so we see here it says hallelujah 
and he that taketh not his cross. Brethren, if you take it not your cross, hallelujah, and follow not after Jesus, you are not worthy of him. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. So I challenge you, if you are not, hallelujah, taking up your cross, denying yourself daily and following Jesus Christ, hallelujah, oh, glory be to God, and you feel like, where is Jesus? I need Jesus, more of Jesus, and you feel like you don't have Jesus, then you need to deny yourself, take up your cross, and follow Jesus Christ so you can be worthy of him. Amen. Hallelujah. I'm not talking about people who label themselves as Jesus Christ. We know there's an antichrist spirit. Amen. The Bible says, hallelujah, oh, glory be to God. If we love mother or father, your mother and your father is not Jesus Christ and they shall not take or should not take the place of Jesus Christ in your life. Your sons and daughters, they are not Jesus Christ and they should not take the place of Jesus Christ in your life. Life. Sometimes God have to remove people from us because they try to play Jesus in our life. They try to take his job, hallelujah, or do his job, and he have left him with no job to do in our life. So sometimes God have to remove people from our atmosphere, from our spirit, from our life, hallelujah, so he can do the job of God who sent him to do the work in our life, the work that he started so that he can finish it and bring it to fruition, right? Hallelujah, oh, glory be to God, amen. Hallelujah. So it says, Hallelujah. And he that take up his cross and follow after me is not worthy of me. Hallelujah. So brethren, I challenge you to deny yourself daily. Take up your cross and follow Jesus Christ. Amen. Deny yourself daily. Take up your cross. And how do you follow Jesus Christ? When you read the word, hallelujah, you know what Jesus did and you can do what he do and greater also. Amen. Jesus said to Peter and, 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 and John and the rest of apostles, follow me, the fishermen, amen, hallelujah, Philip and, and, and Simon, Peter, follow me and I will make you fishers of men, amen, hallelujah, and they followed Jesus, they went from fishermen to fishers of men, amen, hallelujah, oh, glory be to God, amen, hallelujah, hallelujah, it says so, Hallelujah. So they deny themselves as a fisherman, hallelujah, and, and, and pick up their cross and follow Jesus Christ and become a fishers of men. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. And then it says, hallelujah. Notice somewhere I sing, I will make you fishers of men, fishers of men, fishers of men. I will make you fishers of men if you follow me. If you follow me. If you follow me, I will make you fishers of men if you follow me. Right? So, it also goes on to say, he that findeth his life shall lose it. So, brethren, if you find your life, you will lose it. Amen? I found my life. And when it says lose it, it's not talking naturally, spiritually. Amen? Hallelujah, oh glory be to God. I remember in 2014 when I gave my life to the Lord, I found my life in Christ Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah, oh glory be to God. I found my life. And no, I, all right. The song I'm going to sing, I got a new life. I got a new life. If anyone asks you, what's the matter with you, my friend? Just tell them I'm saved and I sanctify. Holy Ghost filled and I fire baptized. I got you. Excuse me. I got Jesus on my side. I got a new life. I got a new life. I got a new life. If anyone asks you, what's the matter with you, my friend? Just tell them I'm saved and I sanctify. Holy Ghost filled and I fire baptized. I got Jesus on my life. I got a new life. Right? So it says, he that findeth his life shall lose it. So if you find your life, you will lose it. The Bible says, hallelujah, we are crucified with Christ. Amen. You lose, you know why you lose your life? You lose your life for Christ's sake. Amen. For Christ's sake. Hallelujah, oh glory be to God. The Bible says, um, hallelujah, oh glory be to God. What was that scripture where it says, um, okay, so this is what the word of God said. It says, Hallelujah. We are crucified with Christ. Nevertheless, it's not I live, but Christ who live in us. So when you lose your life, it's no longer you live, but Christ live on the inside of you. Amen. So if it is you deny Jesus Christ, hallelujah, oh, you are not worthy of him. So he's not going to come and live on the inside of you. Amen. Because you, you deny him. Hallelujah, oh, glory be to God. You deny that he's Lord, that he's Savior. Hallelujah, oh, glory be to God. 
Hallelujah. And therefore, he's going to deny you before the Father. Amen. Hallelujah. He's going to say, depart from you, work of iniquity. I knew you not. You don't want to hear things like that. You want to hear Jesus say, well done, my good and faithful servant in whom I were pleased. Well done, my good and faithful servant. Enter into the joy of the Lord. You want to hear that. Amen. Hallelujah. Okay. So it says, amen. Hallelujah. And and he that findeth his life shall lose it. And he that loseth his life for my sake shall find it. So when you lose your life for Jesus Christ sake you will find your life hallelujah oh glory be to god your life in christ jesus amen hallelujah oh glory be to god amen hallelujah a lot of you cannot find your life amen because you are afraid to lose your life amen hallelujah and, and, and until you hallelujah fear you losing your life you will not be able to find hallelujah your life in christ jesus amen hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah in 2014 i made the decision to lose my life hallelujah i was living a life for the world in the world i was a drug addict hallelujah smoking marijuana joints after joints smoking nicotine smoking hallelujah drinking guinness hallelujah oh glory be to god and punching hallelujah and and and, and gray goose shots after shots after shots no trace hallelujah Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. Drinking, hallelujah, banco wine, hallelujah, and you just name it, hallelujah, oh, glory be to God, all those different kind of things, hallelujah, going party, hallelujah, fornicating, committing adultery, amen, hallelujah, but until I made the decision that I wanted to lose that life, amen, hallelujah, oh, glory be to God, hallelujah, until I made the decision that I'm fed up of that life, I'm tired of living that life, hallelujah, oh, glory be to God, and I allow the Lord to allow me to lose that life, I was able, hallelujah, brethren, what, hallelujah, when you, you lose to gain and you gain to lose, amen, hallelujah, oh, glory be to God, so if you gain, hallelujah, the lifestyle of the world, hallelujah, if you lose it, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna gain the lifestyle that Jesus Christ had for you, amen, hallelujah, I lose the lifestyle of the world that I was living in, I gain the lifestyle of Jesus Christ, I no longer go to the party and clubs and bubble, 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 amen, hallelujah, oh, oh, oh wine panic, grind panic, amen, I know praise, dance to for Jesus, amen, I dance in the presence of the Lord, amen, hallelujah, oh glory be to God, amen, hallelujah, so it says he that, uh, hallelujah, findeth his life shall lose it, amen, I found a life uh, growing up, but it wasn't the life that Jesus Christ uh, wanted for me, amen, he didn't desire for me to be a party goer, hallelujah, a prostitute, hallelujah, a liar, a stealer, a scuffer, a homemonger, a home wrecker, hallelujah, he didn't desire those things for me to be a fornicator, an adulterer, a curse, you understand what I'm saying, a drunkard, a, 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 a dick, a hallelujah, oh glory to God, no, he didn't desire that life for me, amen, oh glory, the life that he desired for me was a righteous life in him amen oh glory be to god hallelujah so he it says he that findeth his life shall lose it so i found hallelujah i found my life amen hallelujah but it was the life of the world the lifestyle of the world hallelujah oh glory. but when i came to encounter jesus christ i lose my life for his name's sake and i find my life in him i got an i could testify hallelujah i got a testimony hallelujah i got a new life i got a new life if anybody asks me what's the matter with me i tell them i'm saved i tell them i'm saved i'm sanctified hallelujah filled with the holy ghost fire baptized i got jesus on my side hallelujah i got a new life amen hallelujah oh glory be to god so we got to give up some things in order to get some things amen so we got to give up that old lifestyle in order to get the new life in christ jesus amen hallelujah and then it says he that receiveth you receiveth me hallelujah brethren hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah there are times in life you feel rejected by people. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. If they reject you, then God will reject them. Hallelujah. Because the Bible says, and he that receiveth you, receiveth me. Hallelujah. Because if they don't receive you, hallelujah, they're not receiving the Christ on the inside of you. They're rejecting and denying the Christ on the inside of you. Amen. 
Hallelujah. And then it says, he that receiveth me, receiveth him that sent me. So when they receive you, they, they receive Jesus Christ and they also receive God who sent Jesus Christ in you. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. So don't be bad when people reject you. Hallelujah. You know that they're not rejecting you. They're rejecting the Christ on the inside of you. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Amen. Hallelujah. They're rejecting the God that sent Jesus Christ on the inside of you. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. It says, and he that receiveth a prophet. Some of you may be prophets. And God may send you to a place, to a church, to a nation, to a tongue, to a kingdom, to a people. To prophesy what does said the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. The Bible says, hallelujah. He that receiveth a prophet in the name of a prophet shall receive a prophet's hallelujah reward amen some people don't want to receive some people because they feel like they, 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 they don't they, they don't have the name of a prophet the title of a prophet amen hallelujah but god can raise up anybody because if god raised up a donkey to, to to speak to a man he can use anybody to speak to prophesy what does say the lord and if you reject that person then you are rejecting a prophet reward and you are rejecting the christ on the inside of them and the god hallelujah who sent christ on the inside of them amen hallelujah oh glory be to god so brother when you go places and you hear the word of the lord and you get up and speak and they try to shut you down or, or, or they try to shush you up hallelujah oh glory be to god know that they are rejecting the christ on the inside of you and the god who sent you hallelujah at least you did your part the blood of them those people will not be in your hand you did your part amen hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah says he that receiveth you, you um he that receiveth a prophet in the name of a prophet shall receive a prophet's reward. Amen. Hallelujah. So whatever the prophet reward is, hallelujah. Because remember, when we run this race, we persevere with matter, matter for us. We have a price. Amen. A reward laid up in heaven for us. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. Revelation talk about those that overcome. He give them a crown of life. Amen. That may be your reward. Amen. Hallelujah. Who knows? Right to the tree of life. Amen. Hallelujah. In the midst of God in paradise. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. So we see here, it says, He that receiveth a prophet in the name of a prophet shall receive a prophet's reward. And he that receiveth a righteous man in the name of a righteous man shall receive a righteous man reward. So if you are a righteous vessel, hallelujah, and you go to a church, a place, a nation, a tongue, and a kindred, and, 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 and people talk about your past, who you was, hallelujah, what you used to do, hallelujah, and skip over seeing that, hey, you are a brand new person in Christ Jesus now because why you gave up that life and you lose that life to receive hallelujah the life in christ jesus amen hallelujah and they they deny to see that hallelujah oh glory be to god they overlook that and they go by who you was in the past and they reject you hallelujah oh glory be to god they see you as a dirty bird or unrighteous person hallelujah the people uh, they see you as a person who people talk about badly amen so they don't want to receive you brethren then they will not have a righteous man reward amen hallelujah because why they rejected you amen hallelujah and they reject him hallelujah jesus is the righteousness of god and when we see jesus christ in the heart as the lord and personal savior we become the righteousness of god in christ jesus amen so because you become the righteousness of god in christ jesus and you go to a people a place a tongue a kingdom and they don't receive you hallelujah then they don't deserve a righteous man reward amen they don't deserve the reward hallelujah oh glory be to god of god that is upon your life amen hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah Abraham was a righteous man and what happened? Hallelujah, oh glory to God. Hallelujah, God bless him. Amen. Hallelujah, oh glory be to God. Noah was a righteous man and what happened? God bless him and his family. Give them a second chance, a new beginning. Amen. Hallelujah. Abraham was a, 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 a upright man. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. He was a righteous man. Amen. Because the Bible says... um. He be, um, because of he believe unto him as right, according unto him as righteousness, amen. Because he believe God, amen. Hallelujah, oh glory to God. He receive a reward, a promise of God, his Isaac, amen. Job, he was a righteous, upright man, amen. Even though he lose some stuff, he was able to receive more than what he have lost, amen. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Mary, she was a righteous woman, hallelujah, and she received Jesus, hallelujah, oh glory to God. 
Hannah received Samuel. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. So, brethren, if it is that, uh, hallelujah, they don't receive you, a man or a woman who is righteous, hallelujah, they shall not receive a righteous man reward. Hallelujah. But if they receive you who is a righteous man when you go, when you are sent, when you are led, hallelujah, oh, glory be to God, and they receive you, hallelujah, then they are able and capable of receiving a righteous man reward. Amen. Hallelujah, glory be to God. And it says, whosoever shall give to drink unto one of these little ones a cup of cold water. Amen. A cup of cold water only in the name of a disciple. Amen. Only in the name of a disciple. Amen. Only in the name of a disciple. Amen. Only in the name of a disciple. What was the disciple's name? Peter, John, Andrew. Hallelujah hallelujah um judas uh i can't remember i can't name all i can't name, name all i think john i can't you can't i can't name all of them right now but hallelujah oh glory to god it says he and whoso shall give to drink unto one of these little ones a cup of cold water only in the name of a disciple brethren Hallelujah. You may not have Peter name, John name, Andrew name, Simon name. You may not have Iscariot name, Judas name. Hallelujah. You, you, you may not have the apostles of the Bible name. Hallelujah. But because you are a follower of Jesus Christ, you deny yourself, take up your cross and follow Jesus Christ daily. You are his follower. Hallelujah. His disciple. And because you are his disciple, you carry the name of a disciple. So if you give someone a cup of water, you are giving them in the disciple name. The Bible says, Jesus says, when you give to Lisa one of these, you have given unto me. So when you give to that person, you're giving unto Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. And when you do that, there's a reward for you. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We bless the name of the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Glory. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. All right. And then it says, Verily I say unto you, he shall in no wise lose his reward. So when you give someone a cup of water in the name of a disciple, hallelujah, you shall, you shall not, you, you're not going to lose your reward. You will not lose your reward. Amen. You will not use your reward. Amen. So brethren, I challenge you to do what it is the word of God says to do. Hallelujah. The word of God says confess before men. Hallelujah. All glory be to God. Hallelujah. And when you confess before men, the Lord Jesus, hallelujah, he will confess you before God, our Father in heaven. Amen. Don't deny him because if you deny him, he will deny you before the Father. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. And brethren, hallelujah. Also, it says, God did not come to send peace on earth. He come not to send peace, but a sword. He sent a sword, the word of God. God sent his son, they call him Jesus, the songwriter sing, and Jesus is the word. And what is the word? The sword. Hallelujah, the sword of the spirit. Let's go to the book of Ephesians. Amen. Ephesians. Hallelujah. Chapter 6, break it down a little to you so you can understand what is the sword of the spirit. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Ephesians chapter 6. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And it reads, Hallelujah. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principality and powers, against rulers uh, of the darkness of this world, uh, of spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God, that he may be able to stand against the evil day, and having all done to stand. Stand therefore, having your lines girt about with truth, and having the breastplate of righteousness, and your feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace right the gospel of peace now we see here it says that think not that i come to send peace on earth i come not to send peace but a sword but the gospel it have it have it have the gospel of peace it have the it have gospel um damnation gospel in other words you understand what i'm saying it have um prosperity gospel you understand what I'm saying? There's a, there's, the, it have, you, as you read the word of God, you, you see there's a, there's a, there's a difference. Amen. Bracket. Hallelujah. In, 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 in the, every area of the Bible. Amen. Hallelujah. So we see here, it says, hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. And your feet shall with the preparation of the gospel of peace. And 
above all taking the shield of faith where you, you are able to quench the all the fiery dust of the wicked the evil one and it says take the helmet of salvation and a sword amen the sword of the spirit what is the sword of the spirit the word of god amen so when jesus say hallelujah think not that i am come to send peace on earth i come not to send peace but a sword he come to send the word of god so when god sent his messenger with his word hallelujah you need to receive the messenger hallelujah because if you don't receive the messenger you are rejecting god who sent the messenger and jesus christ who's speaking through that messenger amen hallelujah oh glory be to god amen hallelujah so when you see god say think not that i come to send peace on earth i come not to send peace but the word of god hallelujah to but a sword to, um, but a sword the word of god amen hallelujah and there's a word amen there's a word there is a word there is a word there is a word hallelujah oh glory be to god in the mouth of god people and i declare you to rise up and speak that word what does said the lord hallelujah he said to ezekiel don't be afraid of their faces amen hallelujah for they are rebellious people amen hallelujah oh glory to god speak that word hallelujah in the midst of those rebellious people it's up to them to take heed hallelujah to the word of god the bible says god don't desire for none perish but for all to come to repentance amen and that may be the word hallelujah repent for the kingdom of heaven is a hand repent and be baptized in the name of jesus christ for the remission of your sins and you receive the gift of the holy ghost it is a promise for you to return to those that are far off repent and come back to your first love jesus christ repent and and do the first work over again. Amen. Repent and come to the Lord with all your heart with fasting, weeping out with mourning. Repent, repent, repent. That may be the message. Amen. The message may be Second Chronicles 7, 14. If my people which are called by my name shall humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways, then will I hear from heaven, forgive their sins, and will heal their land. And I said that my eyes will be open and my ears will attend unto the prayer that is made in this world. The word might be a fire word. Amen. Hallelujah. As it is written in Joel and in Acts chapter 2. Hallelujah. And it shall come to pass afterwards. Our prophet must be upon all flesh. Your sons and your daughters shall prophesy. Your young men shall see visions. Your old men shall dream dreams. Upon my servant and my handmen and daughters. Our prophet must be and they too shall prophesy. There be wonders in the heaven above and signs and earth beneath blood and fire and pure smoke. The sun shall be turned into darkness and the moon into blood before the great and notable day of the Lord comes. And it shall come to pass that whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Access. And Joel says, shall be delivered for there in Mount Zion and in Jerusalem, shall be delivered and in the ram them who the Lord God shall call. Amen. That may be the word. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jonah had a word of God. Hallelujah to the Ninevites. Hallelujah. But he wanted to go the other way. Amen. Hallelujah. And a shock, a whale swallow him. He was in the way of a belly for three days and three nights. He was able to fast. Amen. Hallelujah. And his fasting apparently gave him the strength and the courage to go and do that which God has given him to do. Amen. Hallelujah. So he got spit out to the destination. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. And he went to the rebellious people. He felt like God shouldn't speak a word to the rebellious people. Amen. Hallelujah but anyway he went to the rebellious people and spoke a word amen hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah why because when he was on the board there were turbulence amen and they threw him off board amen hallelujah oh glory be to god and and the whale swallowed him and took him to the destination that he needed to go to so he could go and minister to the, the word of the lord so the people can be saved amen now god will send your places and people will be receptive to the word and some will reject the word if they reject you hallelujah they're rejecting christ jesus and not, not you amen at least you did your part amen and if they receive you then hallelujah glory be to god salvation deliverance healing gonna take place amen hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah so we see here amen it says hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah hallelujah oh glory to god think not that i am come to send peace on earth i come not to send peace but a sword amen hallelujah some crying out saying lord peace 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 we know that when jesus was in the boat with the disciple and it had the turbulence in the water amen that they got frightened and they ran and called jesus he was done beneath the deck resting amen yes jesus rest amen hallelujah this is jesus rest we gotta get rest too amen rejuvenate amen hallelujah and jesus said oh you have little faith and then he speak to the 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 wind and the wave and said peace be still amen hallelujah oh glory to god so it's not just prophets don't just prophesy damnation prophecies don't just prophesy car and land and house and prosperity hallelujah they they prophesy things to come they prophesy the word of god hallelujah oh glory to god hallelujah they prophesy hallelujah 
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Things that have happened before. Hallelujah. Things that is happening now and things that will come. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. And I, I pray that you all stop calling prophets that message, um, prophesy the word of God, damnation prophet. No, they are not damnation prophet. They are God's prophet and they come not with peace, but with the word of God, with the sword. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Amen. And if you reject them, you reject God and Jesus who sent them. But if you receive them, you receive God and Jesus who sent them. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. And you will receive a prophet reward because why you receive a prophet word. Amen. And if it's a righteous man that come, you receive a righteous man reward. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. And so it also goes on to say, hallelujah, hallelujah, that. Hallelujah. Mothers, me, me, uh, fathers will be against daughters, and mothers will be against daughters, and in laws gonna be against in laws, right? And it says, your enemies of your whole household. Amen. If your family not coming up against you, if church people not coming up against you, then then you are not of their household, right? You are part of some other household, right? And you got to know what kind of house, what household are you a part of? Are you a, a, a part of the household of God? A part of the household of Jesus Christ? Amen. Because even in that household, people will come up against you. Amen. Hallelujah. Your family will rise up against you. Hallelujah. Blood and water family will rise up against you. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. And when you see these things, hallelujah, think it not strange. Amen. The word of God says it, that our forces shall be they of our, our own household. Amen. Hallelujah. Your own household will betray you. Hallelujah. The own household will reject you. The own household will deny you. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. Your, 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 um, your own household will leave you for dead. Amen. Hallelujah. You just name it. Amen. Hallelujah. But think it not strange because the Bible tells us. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Uh, and uh, a man falls shall be they of his own household. It says, He that loveth father or mother more than is a word uh we also learned today in the scripture that we should not love our father and mother than than jesus christ because if we do we're not worthy of jesus christ and who don't not want to be worthy of jesus christ i don't know about you but i want to be worthy of jesus christ amen uh so i love god and jesus christ more than i love my mother and father amen hallelujah because why the bible said when my mother and father if your mother and father forsake you for you loving jesus more than them know that the lord will take you up amen the bible says if my mother and father forsake me then the, when my mother and father forsake me then the Lord will take me up. Amen. Hallelujah. He's not saying he's going to kill you and allow you to come home to him. No. Hallelujah. He take you in as his own. Hallelujah. He's going to be a mother to you, a father to you. He's a mother to the motherless, a father to the fatherless, a husband to the widow. Amen. Hallelujah. Uh, a father to the offerings. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Amen. So, so it's, it goes on to say, and he that taketh not his cross and followeth after me is not worthy of me. So, brethren, you don't want not to be worthy of Jesus Christ. You want to be worthy of Jesus Christ. So, I challenge you in your daily life, hallelujah, to take up your, to deny yourself, take up your cross and follow Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. Deny yourself. Take up your cross and follow Jesus Christ. You may say you want to be a drug lord, but Jesus may call you a prophet or a preacher. Deny the lifestyle of a drug lord and take up your cross and follow Jesus Christ. Be that prophet that he called you to be. Jesus is a prophet. And if he called you to be a prophet, you're going to prophesy and prophesy greater than Jesus did. Because he said the work that he did, you're going to do and greater also. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And then it says, He that findeth his life shall lose it. So, brethren, you may find a life in the world that is pleasing to the flesh. Amen. Hallelujah. But killing to your spirit. So that lifestyle may be a drug lord. Hallelujah. A, a porn star. Hallelujah. A, a, a fornicator and adulterer. A, a, a party goer. Right? A, 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 a murderer. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. You just name it. Amen. Hallelujah. But the Bible says, Hallelujah. And he that hallelujah he that findeth his life shall lose it amen brethren because you find that life you're gonna lose it amen hallelujah 
and and and, and it says he that lose it is like because you lose it, that lifestyle for jesus christ's name's sake you're gonna find the life that jesus christ hallelujah created you to live before the foundation of this earth before he formed you in the mother womb he said hallelujah in his word i i, I call you to be a prophet to the nation amen so what i said is that some find the life of a drug lord in the street on the corner in the in the in the um the the the, 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 the houses amen hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah but uh, hallelujah jesus have a better life for them and that better life may be a prophet amen hallelujah so when they lose the life of a drug lord they find a life uh, in christ jesus as a prophet amen hallelujah oh glory be to god right so it says he that findeth his life shall lose it and he that loseth his life for my name's sake shall find it amen it is a good thing to find your life in christ jesus when we find our life in the world hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah it may seem good, sound good, look good, hallelujah, but to God it's not good, hallelujah, to God it's not a righteous life, amen, hallelujah, oh glory be to God, and God desires for us to have a righteous life, to live a holy life, to be holy just as he's holy, to be righteous just as he's righteous, amen, hallelujah, it's up to us to choose, we cannot force nobody to choose the life that they want to live, they gotta choose it for their own self, amen, but we can present the gospel to them of truth, hallelujah, the, the, the gospel of peace, hallelujah, we can present uh, hallelujah the word of god to them which is a sword hallelujah oh, and it's up to them to receive the word of god and allow god to transform their life we cannot transform nobody's life it is god who is the transformer and he transformed our life when we receive jesus christ into our heart as the lord and personal savior transformation take place not outside in but inside out hallelujah oh glory be to god amen i'm a living testimony because i found a life in the world hallelujah before christ amen hallelujah where i used to smoke drink party you just name it amen hallelujah but when i heard about the man named jesus at the age of 22 years old i made the decision amen hallelujah i i always heard of him amen but this time when i heard of him was in a deeper way a deeper form in this when i heard of him at the age of 22 something hallelujah touched my heart hallelujah oh i feel that knocking on my heart oh glory be to god hallelujah and I made that decision to lay down that life that I was living. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God so that I can pick up the life that Jesus Christ had for me. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Amen. Hallelujah. I had an encounter with the Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. He delivered me from that lifestyle. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. I lose that lifestyle. But in losing that lifestyle, I gain a better lifestyle. Amen. The lifestyle that Jesus Christ created. Hallelujah. For me. Form for me. Before the foundation of the earth. Before I was in my mother womb amen hallelujah oh glory be to god and that's uh, the lifestyle hallelujah oh glory be to god as a christian hallelujah oh glory be to god as a faithful messenger hallelujah as a as a as a um as someone who do the work of an evangelist hallelujah as a teacher of the gospel you just name it amen hallelujah oh glory be to god as a prophet hallelujah who have the word of god in my mouth to speak what does yet the lord you just name it amen hallelujah oh glory be to god amen before hallelujah that uh, curse word used to come out of my mouth amen hallelujah it's a curse like hot pepper amen but no i don't curse like hot pepper no more no what come out of my mouth righteousness holiness truth hallelujah oh glory be to god the word of god hallelujah amen so a transformation took place amen hallelujah why because i deny myself take up my cross and i follow jesus christ and because i follow jesus christ i become his disciple amen hallelujah and the things that jesus do i do and greater also because he says it not i says it but he says it his word says it amen hallelujah oh glory be to god so he says here and he that taketh not his cross and follow it after me is not worthy of me brethren if i did not um, deny myself if if i did not take up my cross and follow jesus christ i would not have been worthy of jesus christ he would not have been living on the inside of me i would not have inherited the righteousness that he have because he is the righteousness of god but because i made the decision for myself no one forced me i made it myself amen because i made up in my mind that i don't want to live the lifestyle that i was living anytime anymore 
Hallelujah, oh glory be to God. Hallelujah, it wasn't worth it anymore. Amen. Hallelujah, oh glory be to God. So I made the decision for myself. I choose for myself to, to, to put down that lifestyle, to deny myself. Hallelujah, to take up my cross, to take up the word of God and read it daily. Take up the word of God and follow Jesus Christ daily and do the things that he says in his word to do. Hallelujah, oh glory be to God. Amen. Hallelujah, because I did that, because I do that, and continuously do it i am worthy of jesus christ amen hallelujah oh glory be to god and you too can be worthy of jesus christ all you need to do is make that commitment hallelujah make that sacrifice to lay down that old life so that you can receive the life and a new life in christ jesus hallelujah all you have to do is make that decision to to deny yourself take up your cross and follow jesus christ daily amen and you, brethren, will be worthy of Jesus Christ. Amen. And then it says, he that findeth his life shall lose it, and he that loseth his life shall find it. Amen. Because I lose my life, I found it. Hallelujah. And brethren, I knew when I lose my life. Amen. I, you know, I, I had an experience when I was 22 years old. Hallelujah. I give my life to the Lord. Not many days hence, amen, after giving my life to the Lord, I will smell, you know, when someone die and you put them in a coffin, hallelujah, the smell of a coffin, this, the coffin have a scent, I will have that scent, I will get that scent, and that's how I knew, hallelujah, that I lose my life, hallelujah, that's how I knew I lose the life that I found in the world, amen, hallelujah, but even though I lose that life that I found in the world, amen, hallelujah, I gain life in Christ Jesus, amen. I receive life in Christ Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. I find, hallelujah, life. Amen. Hallelujah in Christ Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. And that life, this life that I found in Christ Jesus is greater and is better than the life that I lose. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. And then it says, he that receiveth you, receiveth me. Amen. Hallelujah. So if your mother and father receive at you, they receive at Jesus. Jesus Christ, hallelujah, on the inside of you. If your pastors and your apostles and the deacons and the evangelists and the teachers, hallelujah, and the bishops, hallelujah, and the church members receive you, then they receive Jesus Christ on the inside of you. If the people in the nation, the tongue, the kindred, and the community receive you, they receive the Jesus Christ on the inside of you. But if they don't receive you, if they reject you, they deny you, they ridicule you, they look down upon you, they oppose you, etc. Hallelujah, they are doing that to the Christ Jesus. Jesus on the inside of you. Don't feel bad. You just keep pepping in your steps and keep doing what it is God has called and created you to do. Dust your feet. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God because there's someone down the road that's going to receive you. Amen. And because they receive you, they're going to receive the Christ on the inside of you. Hallelujah. Oh, glory. If you're a prophet, they're going to receive a prophet reward. If you're a righteous man, they're going to receive a righteous man reward. Amen. Hallelujah. So if you're a prophet and you go and hallelujah to prophesy to a nation or tongue or kingdom or people and they receive your the word of God that is in your mouth, hallelujah, they receive a prophet reward. If you are a righteous man and you go, hallelujah, living a righteous life in the community, hallelujah, the area that you are wrong and the people receive you, they receive a righteous man reward. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And it is a great thing to receive a righteous man reward. It is a great thing to receive a prophet reward. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. And then it says, and whosoever shall give to drink. Remember, Jesus Christ is a prophet too. Amen. So, hallelujah. The prophet is prophesying to the prophet. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. And because you receive the prophet who is prophesying to the prophet, you receive a prophet reward. And what Jesus received, Jesus received live power hallelujah you just name it amen hallelujah because you receive the prophet the prophet hallelujah you receive the prophet reward power you receive righteousness you understand what i'm saying brethren hallelujah oh glory be to god amen because remember when jesus died buried and resurrected he resurrected with power in his hand amen remember god called jesus the righteousness hallelujah jesus is the righteousness of god hallelujah oh glory be to god Jesus is a prophet. Hallelujah. You will become the righteousness of God. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. When you receive that prophet. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Or the word of a prophet. You become, you receive that reward of becoming righteous. Amen. 
Hallelujah. And then it says, And whosoever shall give to drink unto one of these little ones a cup of cold water only in the name of a disciple, verily I say unto you, he shall in no wise lose his reward. So brethren, you as a disciple of Jesus Christ, a follower of Jesus Christ, if someone come to your door and you give them a cup of water, if you give your enemy a cup of water, if you give your neighbor a cup of water, brethren, you will receive, you will not lose your reward. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. Because what, what did what do disciples do? They serve. Amen. Hallelujah. What did Jesus' disciples do? They follow Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. They did what Jesus Christ did. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. Jesus gave that woman water by the well. Not the water in the well, but living water. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. Because she received Jesus. Brethren, let me tell you, that woman, she encountered Jesus because she received Jesus and gave him a cup of water to drink. Hallelujah. She was worthy of the reward of Jesus Christ. She become righteousness. Hallelujah. Because Jesus Christ is righteousness. He forgave her for sin because he called all the things that she was doing. He said, you have five husbands and none of them is yours. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. She realized and know that he was a prophet. She received a prophet. And because she received a prophet, she received a prophet reward. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. 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 She become the righteousness of God. Hallelujah. Because she received the prophet. Hallelujah. She gave the prophet a wa some water to drink. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Amen. She gave the prophet some water to drink. She received not just a, a prophet, um, righteousness, but she received, hallelujah, living water. Amen. The Bible said, all those that believe, all of them shall flow rivers of living water. She, re she received li re living water because Jesus says, if you know who asks you of a cup to drink, you will, you, um, you will ask me. For, for a drink um, because when you drink from Jacob well you will thirst but the water I give you when you drink of that water you will never thirst again amen hallelujah oh glory be to God so brethren it says whosoever shall give to drink unto one of these little ones a cup of cold water only in the name of a disciple Verily I say unto you, he shall in no wise lose his reward. So brethren, you don't want to use your reward, then give. Hallelujah. Give and it shall come back to you. Press down, shake it together, run it over. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. A cup of water, a cup of cold water. Amen. I also want to go to the book of Romans. Romans chapter. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Romans chapter. Romans chapter 10. Verses 13. It says, Whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. No, let's go up a little bit. Romans chapter 10 verses 9 that if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus in other words that Jesus is Lord and shall believe in thine heart that God hath raised him from the dead thou shalt be saved amen why for with the heart man believeth unto righteousness and with the mouth confession is made known unto salvation right for the scripture said whosoever believeth on him shall not be ashamed or put to shame for there is no difference between the jews and the greek for the same lord over all is rich unto all that call upon him for whosoever shall call upon the name of the lord shall be saved it says and how shall they call upon him whom they have not believed, and how shall they believe in him or whom they have not heard, and how shall they hear without a preacher? Right? 
and how shall they preach expect they be sent as it is written how beautiful are the feet of them that preach the gospel of peace and bring glad tidings of good things this is the word of the lord thank be to god so brethren i am here today to tell you that if you confess before men hallelujah jesus will hallelujah oh glory be to god confess you before the lord amen hallelujah and if it is that you are not saved on today and you say what must i do to be saved you just heard the word of god i don't brethren it says how then shall they call on him on whom they have not believed and how shall they believe in him on whom they have not heard and how shall they hear without the preacher? so i'm here today preaching to you good tidings amen and i'm here to let you know that if you confess with your mouth the lord jesus you shall be saved and if you believe it in your heart that god has raised him from the dead you shall be saved amen and if you want to receive salvation on today today is your day of salvation don't let it pass you by tomorrow's promise to no one but you have this day to choose to receive salvation to receive the free gift of eternal life that jesus christ died for us so that we can have amen you don't want jesus to deny you before the father you want jesus to say well done my good and faithful servant enter into the joy of the lord well done my good and faithful servant in whom i'm well pleased amen hallelujah so if that be you hallelujah and your person that love your father and your mother more than you love jesus christ and saying you know what i want to repent and do what god has for us to do which is to love jesus more than loving my mother and father hallelujah oh glory be to god if you're a person that you love your life more um more than um to to lose it and you say you know i heard the word of god hallelujah oh glory be to god i don't want to lose the life that christ have for me so I, I'm, I'm gonna lose the life that the world i receive the that i receive in the world and i'm gonna gain the life that jesus christ have for me and i want to do that i want to repent and ask god to forgive me and i want to take that old life so he can give me that new life in him amen hallelujah if you're someone and you call yourself a disciple hallelujah but yet someone come and ask you for water and you don't give them that water and you say you know what how can i i heard the word go forth today and ask how can i be a disciple or call myself a disciple of jesus christ and yet someone asks for water and i haven't given them a cup of water i said no or move from here or go or should fly no but i mean etc right hallelujah oh glory be to god and if it is your person have been denying jesus christ and not conf and finding fault in confessing him before men and you said you know i heard the word of god and i just want to repent i want to confess right now in the midst of whoever is in the midst of me i just want to confess right now the lord jesus i believe in my heart that god has raised me from the dead so that i can be saved hallelujah not be denied by god by jesus in 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 in, in the in front of my father in heaven hallelujah oh glory be to god and all the rest of things that we mention in the bible amen hallelujah if that is you today and you said i want to repent hallelujah i want to be made justified forgiven of my sin and receive life in christ jesus brother when you have life in christ jesus you understand the word of god and you're able to apply to your life abide by the word of god hallelujah oh glory be to god and live out the word of god walk out the word of god hallelujah oh glory. become a living epistle let your life become a living epistle that's why it's important to have life and only in jesus christ we receive life amen and order to receive jesus christ you have to love your love jesus more than you love your mother and father amen hallelujah so if you feel like you're dead amen some people are dead because they love their children more than they love jesus christ you understand what i'm saying hallelujah oh glory be to god so brethren if you no longer want to be dead you want to be alive in christ jesus the bible says arise sleep us from the dead and that will give you light amen hallelujah it said arise and shine for your light of coming the glory of god is risen upon you and if that's you you've been sleeping and you want to rise from the dead I challenge you hallelujah you may have been dead because you love hallelujah your sons and your daughters and your mother and your father more than you love jesus christ today is the day hallelujah oh glory be to god to deny yourself take up your cross and follow jesus christ and love jesus christ more than you love hallelujah sons and daughter more than you love mother and father
have oh glory be to god so that you can have the life that jesus christ hallelujah signed for you to have or then for you to have choose for you to have hallelujah oh glory be to god in him amen hallelujah so if that's you and you want to repent hallelujah oh glory be to god i would love to pray with you right where you are hallelujah you can lift your eyes to the hill somewhere you have come from hallelujah you can bow your head close your eyes hallelujah and confess the lord hallelujah oh glory be to god jesus as you believe in your heart if you have unbelief may the lord help you unbelief the great songwriter always sing this song and my late bishop hallelujah rest in peace bishop hallelujah we give honor to you hallelujah only believe only believe only believe all things are possible if you only believe hallelujah we challenge you to believe on today we're not here to force you if you feel like you're not ready to make that commitment i here to tell you that tomorrow is promised to no one hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah we are the work our own salvation if you are trembling and you got to work that out for yourself amen but i can present you the gospel hallelujah be the bridge leading you hallelujah to the romans road to salvation hallelujah hallelujah so you can become the righteousness of god so that you can be worthy of jesus christ hallelujah oh glory so you can become a disciple of jesus christ etc amen hallelujah and have that life in christ jesus amen so if that's you today and you're ready to make that commitment you're ready to sacrifice and lay down that old life hallelujah ready to sacrifice and love jesus more than you love mother and father and sons and daughter so that you can be worthy of jesus christ if that is you you're ready to become a disciple of jesus christ that if anybody ask you for a cup of cold water you are able to give it to them hallelujah oh glory be to god if that is you brethren hallelujah right where you are hallelujah i want to pray with you hallelujah oh glory be to pray this prayer with us say lord jesus i admit that i am a rebellious sinner in need of a savior i believe that jesus christ is lord of my life he is the son of god he died buried and resurrected on the third day i confess that you jesus christ is lord of my life and i ask that you come into my heart and save me of all my sins take my name out of the book of death and write it in the lamb book of life create in me a clean pure heart and place your holy spirit your right spirit your son jesus christ on the inside of me hallelujah so that i can have life hallelujah oh glory be to god hallelujah and lead me to the way everlasting thank you lord jesus for saving me in jesus name hallelujah oh glory be to god amen if you said a prayer congratulations welcome back hallelujah because you receive jesus christ into your heart as a lord and personal savior you now are the righteousness of god now i challenge you to do what the word of god says love jesus more than you love family more than you love relatives more than you love loved one deny yourself take up your cross and follow jesus christ and i will read the word of god daily and in there there's instruction for us before leaving this earth follow those instructions apply it to your life walk it out live it out hallelujah oh glory be to god do what jesus did and you will do greater also hallelujah because the greater one lives inside of you his name is jesus the songwriter say i'm more than a Say with the holy ghost his name is jesus i'm born a winner uh, 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 uh. I can't remember this song, but his name is Jesus. I'm on a winner. Okay, you're with me, Holy Ghost. Uh, I don't know this. I can't remember this song, but yeah, right? So I challenge you to do what the Word of God says to do. Amen. Hallelujah. I pray that you will bless one today. If you will bless, please tag and share and invite someone so they too can be blessed on today. Father, we just thank you for each and every soul that we dedicate their life to you. Hallelujah. That become the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. That have denied their old lifestyle and received their life in you, Lord Jesus. Have died to self so you can live in them. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Father, we just thank you, Lord Jesus, for those that desire and decided to love you more more than they love mother and father and sons and daughters father we thank you for those that decided to make to become your disciple that if anyone come asking for a cup of water they will be able to give it to them so that they will not lose their reward father we just thank you for enlightening your people understanding we just thank you for all you have done today what you're about to do i pray that father god there is 
Hallelujah, yeah. And they will just not just be here, but doers of the word of God. I pray that their brain was like a sponge to absorb everything that you have taught them on today. Lord, in the name of Jesus. Father, as we depart from this broadcast, but not from your present mark us over the blood that I'm the evil pass over. Continue to show us all the way is Jesus. I let the words of our mouth and meditation of our heart be acceptable in thy sight, O God. Our strength and our redeemer and act as you strengthen. Hallelujah and empower your people to do that which is right in your eyes. Hallelujah to hold fast to the word of God. God, in the name of Jesus. Father, we even pray for those, Father Lord, that have rejected your prophets. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. And because of the rejection of the prophets, they have not received a prophet reward. We pray those that have rejected the prophets, they will repent of their sin and they will be able to be receptive. Father, remove any skill and balance from the eyes that is blocking up the sea and know the truth of your true prophet that was sent by God. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. And your son, Jesus Christ, speaking through them. Hallelujah. The word of God. Lord, hallelujah, oh glory be to God. We pray that they receive the word of God so that they can receive a prophet reward. Hallelujah, those, Father God, have denied a righteous man, Father God, and have not received a righteous man reward. We pray that uh, you remove the skin and the bands from the eyes so that they can see, hallelujah, this person hallelujah that they are put on christ hallelujah and they are the righteousness of god in christ jesus hallelujah and they are not their past or where they came from hallelujah but they are who you say you are the righteousness of god in christ jesus father we pray that they will see and understand that i receive that righteous man i receive a righteous man reward in the mighty name of jesus father we just thank you and father we just praise you on this day hallelujah we pray father god in the name of jesus for those that feel ashamed to come confess your name before men we pray that you will take away the shame and they will know that you die for their shame so there's no reason to be ashamed of confessing the lord jesus in front of men hallelujah oh glory be to god we pray that they will come to the understanding and know father what if they deny you before men you will deny them before the father in heaven and father god is not a good thing for me to be denied by you or by god or father in heaven so we pray that they will come to the understanding and gain wisdom and knowledge and understanding and do what the word of god says to do to confess the lord jesus so they can be saved from rejection from denial in the name of jesus hallelujah father we just thank you and praise you preserve this prayer preserve your people preserve their salvation preserve the prophets preserve the righteous men hallelujah preserve your disciples oh god for your use father we thank you for continuing to set them apart Hallelujah, oh glory be to God for your sake, Father, in the name of Jesus and use them for your glory. Father, we thank you and we praise you and we love you because you first love us. Hallelujah, oh glory be to God. Let the words of our mouth the meditation of our heart be acceptable in thy sight, oh God. Our strength and our redeemer in Jesus' mighty precious name we are praying. Hallelujah, now unto him that is able to keep us from falling and to present us for us before his presence like seed and joy. To the only wise God our Savior, both majesty, the minute and power, both now and forevermore in Jesus' name. And those of you that said the salvation prayer hallelujah the prayer of repentance the prayer of reconciliation hallelujah go thy way and sin no more as you go may the lord be with you may his face shine upon you may he be gracious unto you may he turn his face towards you and give you peace if you don't have a church home i challenge you pray ask the lord to lead you and guide you to a church that teaches true doctrine where you can learn more about god grow towards god and speak to maturity so he can use you in a mighty way because we all have a purpose and a corner in our life and it's important that we know what our purpose and corner is get trained equipped and taught hallelujah so we can be effective in it and do hallelujah the will of god of him that sent us hallelujah oh glory be to god and fulfill that purpose and cause so when jesus come back we can hear well done my good and favor servant in whom i well pleased well done my good and favor servant enter into the joy of the lord hallelujah glory be to god and we also pray hallelujah father god in the name of jesus we come before you and praying for every person that have the lifestyle of a drug addict every person that have the lifestyle of a prostitute every person that have a lifestyle of a murder hallelujah of a homosexual hallelujah every person that have a lifestyle of a drug addict hallelujah of a drunkard every person that have a lifestyle of a stealing hallelujah every person that have the lifestyle of raping every person that have the lifestyle hallelujah oh glory be to god of manipulation and intimidation every person that have the lifestyle hallelujah of witches and warlocks and witch doctors and uh, any person that have the lifestyle of going to the butter nicker and casting spells evil spells hallelujah what 
whoever it is. Lord, you know them all by name and number. We pray, Father God, hallelujah, that they will lose that life. Hallelujah, oh, glory be to God, so that they, hallelujah, can receive the life that you have for them in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah, pray that they will deny themselves, take up their cross and follow you in the mighty name of Jesus. We pray that they will understand that there's a better way and there's a greater life in Christ Jesus for them. And we pray that they will choose and choose well, Father. We can't choose for them, but they can choose for themselves. And we pray that you enlighten, understand, and remove the skin and the blindness from their eyes so they can see the truth, know the truth, and be set free. In the mighty name of Jesus, we pray that you raise them up to be powerhouse. Hallelujah. In good influence, trendsetters. Hallelujah. Powerful prophets, prayer warriors, worshippers, winners. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God in your kingdom. Revivalists. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Messengers. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God in your kingdom, Father. Builders. Hallelujah. Teachers. Hallelujah. In your kingdom, Father. Soul winners. In your kingdom, Father. Winning the loss at any cost for your son, Jesus Christ. Father, we thank you. And Father, we praise you on, day. And on this day. We Father God, put the bloodstained banner upon them. Cover them, oh God, under the blood of Jesus. Draw them in by the number, oh glory be to God. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, win them one by one, two by two. Hallelujah. A thousand, two thousand, ten thousand. Bring them to flight, oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Father God, so that they can become the righteousness of God and live the life that you have called and created and ordained for them before the foundation of this earth and in their mother's womb. For them to live father we thank you and we praise you on this day in jesus mighty precious name lord not my will your will be done and it's not your will for none parent but for all to come to repentance we pray that they repent of their sins and be converted be justified forgiven of their sin and receive life and so time of refreshing the presence of the lord will come upon them oh god in the mighty name of jesus we pray that they will baptize in the name of jesus christ and put on christ hallelujah be forgiven of their sin hallelujah blood wash hallelujah receive the gift of the holy ghost and receive the power of god to be effective witness in jerusalem judea somewhere and the uttermost part of the earth in the name of jesus father we thank you and we praise you on this day in jesus mighty precious name thank you for hearing and answering prayers in a suitable manner as we call upon your name oh god hallelujah we bless your name we magnify your name hallelujah we thank you for answering in advance in jesus mighty precious name we are praying Amen, amen, and amen. I love you all so much in Jesus. Jesus love you all too. Thank you for joining us uh, for our midday service here at Freedom Reign Empowerment for Jesus Christ. Here deliver us and the fire of God ministry unto the Lord. Until then, Shabbat Shalom. Have a blessed week in the Lord. And God bless you. Tell someone about the salvation plan of Jesus Christ so they can be saved. And experience the love of God for themselves. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Hallelujah. And love on somebody today with the love of God. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name, I love you. I love you. I love you. And Jesus love you too. God bless you. Until then, Shabbat Shalom.